Well, today is the 29th of October 2023, and uh, we've made a, a little escape from our home. The country. Escaped, well, <laughs> <laughs> we've escaped. We've escaped Parma, we've escaped Hanover, and uh, we've come over to the other side of the island. And uh, so this is going to be our home for the next couple of nights. Uh, it's called the uh, CM Hotels, Mallorca Palace, and uh, we're in the east coast of the island. Now this is the entrance to the hotel, so we'll just go in there. You have to spot your chance as you go through the revolving door. And uh, the door's just open for dinner, so people going down there. And down below, that's where the spa is, just down there. And uh, saunas, uh, hairdressers and various other rooms. This is the bar. Um, we've already seen a wonderful pianist here last night. There's the reception. And uh, this is the bar. So this is the sort of a quadrangle. Everything seems to be around the swimming pool, which is just in front of us. Beautifully manicured gardens, as you'd expect. This is the beach bar. Open till six, she said. Yeah, another half an hour. Look at the pomegranates. Whoa. There's the pomegranates on the tree, look. At least I had some pomegranates the other day and they were terribly bitter. They weren't Tr real. Try to, <laughs> try to persuade me to have some. No. So, people have now left the pool area. Just the odd one or two left. Uh, I guess they're going back to the rooms, get ready for their evening meals. See one or two people sitting out on the balconies. So we've got a little splash pool there, the main swimming pool, and then there's another pool a little bit higher up. Plenty of sunbeds, and uh, the sun's just going to start setting soon. Play table tennis tomorrow, darling. Just a table tennis down there. This tree is a lemon tree. And another lemon tree. Be able to get some fresh lemons. They look a bit green at the moment. Not many yellow ones. We, have we got, we've got some yellow ones, haven't we? Not many, no. no. Hello. We've got a, a ground floor room. And this is our corridor. Three oh eight, three oh seven, nearly there. So it's three oh six. We've got my little key to put in the lock. And just push the key in here. Oh, and the lights on. So this is where we're going to spend the next day or two. I'll go straight into the room, we'll come back to the bathroom in a moment. And uh, that's our bedroom. All our luggage was brought to us, so it's all been put out safely. Plenty of cupboards here. Mm -hmm. 
was within a cupboard. Oh, got some slippers down there. Dressing gowns. Plenty of cupboard space. We're only here for a couple of nights, so it doesn't really matter, does it? Let's just have a quick look in the bathroom. So we've got a separate toilet there. Phone in the toilet. His and her sinks. All the toiletries are here. The all important hair dryer and the mirror. I bet Anita's bought her own. <laughs> of course she has. No, Probably won't be strong enough this one. She likes to have a high powered mirror. Coming on through. Not the Tea and coffee, all set up there. The lady said the mini bar, I don't know, found the mini bar. Where's the mini bar, dear? Anyway, she said all the first drinks are free, so. And then, uh, and then we have to pay to get it filled up. I'm to order, draw the curtains back. to open it and to close and uh, we're on the ground floor as you can see we've got somewhere to sit somewhere to lie and uh, we're right down by the pool area uh, a lot of people sitting around the pool bars open can't see many people in it though uh, I think the hours change so the, the sun will be going down Anyway, that's a first look at the room and uh, we'll show you a bit more of the hotel in the next bit. And I've just located the mini bar. Oh, there we go. And a uh, safe up there. All the instructions. There's the, the mini bar. So I've got, we've got two Cokes and two Fantas on the house. <laughs> oh. mm. No water. No water. No alcohol. And this is the restaurant for this evening. And we've got a cocktail tonight before we go in for dinner. Well, when we arrived at the hotel, uh, the lady said uh, she wanted to invite us to a cocktail. And uh, well, we decided to have it this evening what before dinner. Black it looks good, it? pretty dark, and uh, well, let's, I don't know what it tastes like. Cheers. Oh, cheers, don't know. Cheers, cheers, cheers. <laughs> it's got coffee in it. Cheers. Cheers, thank you. Cheers, mm. I think it's very good. Such a great uh, choice of things. I've got a bit of a mixture here, so I've got some fishy things on this side. I've even had a little bit of sobra cider on this side. Uh, just because we're in Mallorca, why not? And then Anita recommended this. I'm still not sure what it is. I think it's got goat's cheese on the top. Very nice. Well, it looks a bit brighter and sunny yet today. Parasols are all out. It's just nine o'clock in the morning, so nobody round the pool yet. So I'm thinking probably will be today.
and we're off to breakfast now. And of course, um, I wouldn't go out without a, a full English. Down below, that's where the spa is, just down there. And uh, saunas, uh, hairdressers and various other rooms. This and uh, a, sauna, a sauna area. Well, we thoroughly enjoyed our stay at the CM Mallorca Palace in Sacoma and had a really good time. Thanks very much for watching and we look forward to seeing you in the next one. Bye for now.